Hey guys and dolls, so happy 8th month cute anniversary to yours truly, your favorite little fat girl Diamond here. And I have some wonderful, marvelous news to report that just could not wait till I did my keto diary. It just can't. I, I have to tell everybody about it. My mom's over there walking. I didn't see her out there. Anyway, so I came outside to the bonfire because I thought it'd be a little more quiet. It's not probably going to be because I see three chihuahuas in a lab who loves to play fetch and is very demanding. <laughs> so anyway, you know, check this out. I mean, it don't look too great right now, but it's got all these pretty yellow flowers growing. I don't know if y'all can see them too good. Hold up. See if y'all can see me real good. <laughs> so anyway, my brilliant, most wonderful, fab fantabulous news is this morning I got up and I got on the scale. And I had to check it four or five times because it just didn't seem right. And I always do that because I always kind of think my scale must be broken. <laughs> Well, anyway, it's not. <laughs> I've had other people check and step on it, and it's their weight, too. So, uh, well, I don't know which one to go by, but I'm going to go by the highest number because the other number just sounds too ridiculous. So, at first, all I got three separate readings, even resetting my scale, I got 222.2. Well, I was 227.2. Two yesterday so I was thinking five pounds that's an awful lot overnight and uh, of course it's not exactly all fat but of course some of it is because I'm keto <laughs> I'm eight month keto too so um, this the weight I'm going with is 224.2 because that was the final weight I got on the fourth try so <laughs> that puts me down 87 point I can't remember hold on 87.8 pounds on my keto anniversary. Now, there's a few reasons why my weight went down so much this morning. Is uh, PMS is finally over for me. <laughs> finally. I also let go of some imagined stress, some stress that was mental and was just bugging the hell out of me. I got better hydrated. I've got more sleep lately. And I've been taking my vitamins properly. So, yes. Now, um, I get to star my my goal of 225 later on. I'll do that later. But I'm so very thrilled that I finally get to put a star on that. I can't even tell you. This here, guys, is a list of all my medical problems that I wrote down from my doctor's uh, website. And of course, some of them I'll probably never get rid of, like the B12 and the vitamin D deficiency, because they're quite common. So it's, it's pretty much a thing for most people. But some of this stuff is gone already. And I'm going to tell you about those real fast. So, of course, I'm still working on my high blood pressure, so I can't start that yet. But we're working on that. Sleep apnea, gone. Restless leg syndrome, gone. OCD, can't get rid of that. <laughs> uh, migraines, haven't had one in the longest time, probably before I started keto. Might not be keto related, maybe, I don't know. Alright, so, bradycardia. Uh, don't know what that was exactly, but it's gone. <laughs> IBS. Pretty sure that's just where my gut was messed up for me, all, all the crap I was eating. Hello, Luna. Little tiny dog. Um, stress at home. I've gotten rid of a whole bunch of stress. Uh, just my daughter-in-law going away. It's kind of helpful. <laughs> Little jerk face. Uh, joint and back pain. Bye-bye. <laughs> Urinary incontinence. Thing of the past. Thank God. Uh, which was both a combination of it being very, very heavy and um, a water pill that they had me on. Spasmatic colon. I got no clue where that came from or why they thought I had it. But it didn't affect me. So I don't care. So we're going to say this gone. <laughs> Slow heart rate. I never had one. I don't know why the hell that's on my doctor's paperwork. I had a very fast heartbeat, 110 beats per minute. And now it's about, it's between 67 and 86 all the time, somewhere in between there. All right. Severe obesity. Gone. Still obese, but not severely. <laughs> and, of course, the piece de la resistance, uh, type 2 diabetes. <laughs> Gone. Gone. Goodbye. Farewell. 
And uh, now there's a couple others on here that might be gone. I have a doctor's appointment for a month or so from now to get uh, like a full workup. So I don't know if the liver's still fatty or what all that is. But I just thought I'd share that with y'all because this is my eighth month anniversary on keto. So I'm very proud of myself. I'm very proud of all you ladies for and gentlemen for sticking with it and doing well. Please let me know how y'all doing today and if you have any new victories to share because I'm so, so pleased to have three pounds gone or at least three pounds, maybe five. We'll find out tomorrow what the scale's saying, but I know it's at least three pounds. Uh, much love to y'all, y'all. I will see y'all later.